Good morning. Good morning. Bonnie with Ada is here. I'm burning early. It is uh, pouring out rain outside. Uh, it's Saturday. And I am getting ready to go out and pick up some water today. And some, uh, some milk and hopefully find some eggs. So that's going to be the day today, guys. I want to show you something, guys. I want to show you something that I did have. I do have. Stashed away. But uh, Dragonflies, Ozark Homestead. Um, check out her channel, guys. Because I totally forgot about this item that I love so much. And I had in mind to order more. And that was, what, two years ago? And I totally forgot. So she reminded me. I say people come to your life. It's a godsend. It's a godsend, guys. Truly believe it. When something uh, pops up on, into your screen that talks to you or say something, God has sent that message to you. And I am sure that many of y'all will take advantage of going to her channel and checking out because this is something that is is worth the money. Okay, guys, welcome back to Vanny with Ada's channel. It's 8.30 in the morning, and just as Amazon promised me yesterday when I made an order, um, that it would arrive overnight, and it did. Guys, uh, it's been half an hour. They made it here between uh, 4 a.m. and 8 a.m. They got here at 8 a.m. So I'm going to show you what I received and a few items that I have been receiving and a few items that I already got some time ago um, that is very essential to have in every home. Here is what uh, Christina from Dragonfly's Ozark Homestead put on her link and I do have but I tore it up. I think I'm about down to here on one can. And the other ones are just stashed away. So she put a link up. And Ada's head said, boom, I fully forgot about it. And I ordered two guys that were on sale. Okay. So um, you get 33 servings. Depending on how you use it. Because let me tell you, I got more out of the can <laughs> than what it does say. And I made a pot. It creamy, just like it says it. And then I want to show you something else. This is for my snow blower. This was just 10 bucks. The bundle if you get the, the machine, if you want it. I said, you know what? I do have extension cords, but this one has something special. Okay? It's like a waterproof um, compartment. So, guys, I got it for 10 bucks. Okay? And then. I just unwrapped these because I got these uh, yesterday. I have one, but I ordered two more because they were only seven dollars, guys. Seven dollars for the um, for the uh, uh, what do you call these things? Uh, the lantern candles. Okay, so I got two, and I do have one. Okay, so for seven forty, no, seven dollars and forty nine cents, guys. You can't beat it on Amazon. I'll put a link up on the top if anyone is interested. I do have the fuel, and I do have extra wick that I ordered, and I had no idea what that wick was for, but I found out it, I had ordered it for my other lantern um, candle, and, and they're pretty big, guys. They're twelve inches. Okay, they are big. They look small. But guys, they are big, okay? And then you get a little bit of draw heat, and it's safe for home. Moving along now. I haven't charged this in, I got it like, what, three months ago? Look at the charge, guys. And I haven't even charged it. It's not charging either. I just put it up there to show you. Here's the plug right here. Okay, here's the plug right here. Okay, and here's the piece. You put it in, where are we? I can't see. Oh, you put, you plug it in here. Okay, yeah, charging, you plug it in here, and then you completely 
charge it. It has cigarette lighter, three USB ports, and two regular three prong. And then it has the power inverter built in, 1200 amps, guys. So, and it's a 12 volt. It's, uh, in total, 1200 watts. And it also has a a compartment and with my coupon okay this is the string is jamming it up from opening it up okay okay I got one big mess up here anyway the only thing in here is the uh, battery terminal like if you needed a jump start okay that's what's in there there's plenty of room in here to put something else but I don't need anything else in there and then here on the side it's a LED light compartment, so all you have to do is flip it up, and you have lighting, depending on where you need the lighting at, okay, there it is, guys, and listen to that, that okay, and this thing weighs about 70 thousand pounds, then, here I have the 300 so I haven't charged it in months I've used it but it doesn't charge and here's my headlamp I keep my leg my headlamp um, because this would be my, my carry and go and this has a long long range that one right there it has a long range guys and this was like six dollars on Amazon I've had it for two years already that's my snow time. Go out there and shovel your ass. Okay, shovel your car out. So it also has uh, one three prong, two USBs, um, another three charging the, uh, ports, um, the power, the power button. Okay. And uh, it does uh, kind of ventilate when it has to. And let me tell you something. This thing charges, and I've charged my laptop. I've played around my laptop. I've done stuff on my laptop, Florida, here, New Jersey. Um, and let me tell you something. It stays charged. Um, if I lose, it might be maybe one bar within the three months. Period. So, guys, Bella. So I just wanted to show you a uh, so far, okay? And I do have an extra one. Uh, my daughter has it in her room. She keeps it charged. She keeps it by her uh, nightstand area, just in case. Okay, guys? So that's just a little something that I wanted to show you. Um, this is highly recommended right now. I think there's only a few left on Amazon for $7.49, guys. Um, I get it. I do have a gallon of fluid. So, I think for now, it's okay. And the extension cord. And now we're going to wait for the snow blower. Okay, guys. Yeah. We're going to wait for that. So, I'll have another video up for you uh, sometime later today. I'm going to check and see how far the snowblower is from my door, okay, uh, when they come. And always keep uh, box cutters, okay. This is a small one, but it comes with a bigger one. So, I keep one here for opening boxes. And you never know, I have it by the door, guys. Anyway, just wanted to show you. Um, that Ada is doing the thing because of the channels that I watch and they tell me how to do and they show you how to have something that is not really expensive at all and some of the stuff other stuff you can make it DIY and I was watching a lot of other channels that started like that 
but they went into the mode they switched completely from showing how to do this and and being nice and humble and sweet because i used i loved them before they became fear mongers i'll just say it just like that guys they became the fear mongers they started talking a mile a minute and um in these hard times you can't be you shouldn't be i don't think they should do that it takes a lot to continue to watch them okay so i made a comment yesterday on one of them i truly you know love the channel um but lately every time he pops up he's scaring the heck out of you know people are already stressed out with the situations people suffer from they didn't suffer from anxiety are suffering from anxiety i was at the doctor's office yesterday guys you wouldn't believe the things that I was hearing about what's going on, okay? Um, and if you go back into two years ago, okay, where everything was going to disappear, it's still foundable, okay? Um, so some, some YouTubers... Um, I'm not going to mention any names. I even hate it. I just put, you know, innocent um, comments. Like, you know, you started, you know, on a slow pace. And now you're just ramping and just scaring people out. I mean, you know, you you have changed. The channel has changed. And I got a really nasty-ass response, a sarcastic response on the comments. I didn't mean any harm by it. Um... I just said, you know, the channel has changed drastically from when I was watching them for some long, for a long time. Well, guys, um, I got a very sarcastic, nasty response from somebody that I said, wow. But he never spoke like that. He was just the humblest person. I always used to watch him because he gives good tips. Even though he did that, I still, you know, um... I still know that he has a good heart, um, but the social media platform are changing a lot of people, and that is drawing people away, okay, that is drawing people away, because people already wake up with figuring out what the heck is going on today, how do I make two and two together today, you know, people are trying to ramp up on their needs, necessities, a lot of us don't have the income to do it. And yet, they showed us, and they started us with doing this, get that, get that, do this, get that, a little bit of news. But now they talk a mile a minute, and it's always the same thing, ramping, 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 ramping. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? It's the what you're going to do. The what you're going to do this. What you're going to do in this. What you're going to do this is happening here or there. What you're going to do. You know, that kind of stresses the hell out of people, especially when you open up your eye and you say, well, let me see what's going on, and you haven't even had a cup of coffee. Guys, you know what I'm talking about. Do you feel that way? Um, have you watched any channels like that? So I didn't mean any wrong. I really did not mean any wrong, but it happened. It happened, and I just said your attitude right there what you commented on my comments, commented back to me, um, he didn't have to go there. Guys, he did not have to go there. He did not have to. I was talking about, you have channel has changed drastically. Um, and they put a comment up there, guys, they even... You know, you want to know what they, what, I don't know, I mean, I, I, I just, I just shut it off. I went to the next, um, left it at that, but the comment I received back from that person, now I don't trust them, is, did I watch a video from, I don't know how, how long ago, when he was unclogging a toilet with a penny or something like that, guys, I, I, I can't even remember, guys. You know, that was a, a stupidest, the most lowest. He went down to his lowest to, to say that to a person who 
cooperates with his job, okay? So I will be taking my membership out of the hell out of there. And uh, he's from uh, in the New York area upstate. Yeah. Somewhere around the New York area upstate where they got blasted with the snow. He's from up there somewhere. Uh, I'm sorry. My memberships are coming off and, and off of the channel. Um, that was uncalled for. That was really dirty. Okay. To me, that was really dirty. I was like, wow. So, I said, I, I commented back, you know what? That answer you just put there, the comment you put there for me, it just shows the person that you actually are. So, what I said the first time, I it just shows that I am correct. And I left it at that, guys, because you didn't have to mention a toilet. What are you telling me that? I'm a piece of shit, or um, why don't I go back to cleaning toilets or something like that? You know, something, you know, it, it's not right, guys. So sometimes you may even be afraid to comment on people's channels because you don't know how they're going to come out. But I was just trying to just give him a little tip to help him. You know what I mean? He don't need no damn help anyway. But to make it better for everybody. I just wanted to just, you know, see if, if it would tone it down a little bit. Dang. I mean, it doesn't hurt. It's your channel. If people, you know, um, love your channel and they can give you a little advice, why throw dirt on them? They've been with you since day one. Yes, I've watched all his videos. Um, I learned some odds and ends with his videos. But for the past year and a half, it's just, just scaring the crap from the moment you click onto the phone. And I always look forward, when I open my eye without having coffee, brushing my teeth and my face, I always look forward to watching, you know, catching up a little bit. And if I have to pause it, I'll pause it and I'll get my coffee and then I'll sit down and watch. And Oh, no. Well, it doesn't matter anyway. Losing me, is, me getting off the channel, losing me, it's not going to hurt the person. Okay, but um, it's very sad because I really did like the channel. But a lot of people, even a lot of comments, because I read the comments that um, people make videos. And I see a lot of people go on distress. A lot of people can't make ends meet. A lot of people went through hardships. But then again, there's so many, so many people subscribe that you can't, you cannot answer. But because I commented and it came up on the top, that was the response I got, guys. Okay, did I see the video when he was cleaning a dirty toilet? Uh, unclog the toilet and fix the uh, what why would a penny something like that. I, I have no idea what he was talking about guys I never saw that video, but I've seen thousands of videos that he has um, But it's very sad of how they open a channel and Then they get rude with the people that are supporting the channel. So I am one less supporter there Boom gone, but I'll keep watching because you never know, you know, something could help you. I still watch them. I don't knock them down for that. But you're not going to talk to me. You're not going to comment to me like that. I already know your two colors now, so, um, no, my memberships came down, okay? Um, I have other subscribers. I have other people that I'm subscribed to that I have memberships with, and they are, I love them to death, guys. Anyway, I wanted to thank, um, I already mentioned the name on the other video. Uh, Christina, thank you. Because um, I got them today, guys. <laughs> I got them today. Overnight, okay, overnight. So, guys, there is my, okay, my power source. I'm going to use this one for the small blower. Okay, and there is a uh, cart with wheels that this goes inside the cart and I can wheel it because this thing weighs like 70 pounds. Alright guys, and um, this baby here, I sent one to my youngest son in Florida. I have one, my daughter has one. My brother in New York, upstate New York, he has his van hook up with one of those and the um everything set up you know um the van conversion he has he has power in his van so i mean i didn't i didn't send him one um and i have two more on the windows guys let me let me just show you really quick yeah i, 
I uh, this one I gave it to my brother. Here was supposed to be the 400 power inverter uh, that he tore the box apart, and I had to refix it and um, add the charge controller. And this one I have it here, just if I need it, okay. And um, the other one is in um, my daughter's room, in the window also, uh, just in case. You know, it's good to have multiple multiple of them so that's about as far as i would go with them um and then you got you know my heating my my fireplaces and stuff like that that really works i truly recommend them so guys go back to my videos and um you will see look at my tree so guys sometimes you don't mean any harm and sometimes people be afraid to comment nothing bad but they take it the wrong way, you know? And the reason why I said it, because um, he says that he watched it. He watches, uh, he heard from the other four uh, YouTubers, and I know who they are. And let me tell you guys, if you want a heart attack, just watch them. All you gotta do is watch them. But I quit watching them, guys, because my stress levels were so high. So, if if they would, like, and a lot of people have comments on those channels. I don't watch anymore. Um, if they would comment, you know, give things a little easier, because there's elderly people out there. They make anybody sick out there. You don't know what people are going through right now. Um, uh... You could end your video, and you can you can send 50 people to the hospital with anxiety and, and, and what not, guys. So, I don't know what is the purpose of, you know. If you're a humble person in the beginning, stay humble, okay? You want to teach stuff, teach stuff. Odds and ends, we love variety. Me as a watcher, okay, of YouTube channels. I like to learn from others. I want to know what's going on from others. But I am not going to talk a mile a minute and scare the crap out of you. I mean, do they talk to their wives and their husbands a mile a minute and just scare the crap out of them all day long? I don't know, guys. I don't think so. I really don't think so. Do they talk to their children like that? Because this one has small children. Do they talk to the children a mile a minute and just scare the heck out of their kids because uh, they left one shoe here and the other one cannot be found? Do they yell at them like that? So, according to your channel, is how your personality is also looked at. And a lot of them forgot where they came from. They came from uh, doing all kinds of heating sources to ramping a mile a minute and scaring the crap out of everybody. I don't think that's right. And then on the comments, uh, they're all associated together. It's like, whoa. But I didn't care about that. I cared about the channel, really. I cared about that channel, even though it was a mile a minute. I'll just watch it a mile a week, okay? <laughs> that's what I would do. But damn, very sad guys, that people change in a hot minute with a little comment that really I didn't mean any harm to that. So guys, y'all have a great day. Um, let's see what I can pick up at the supermarket today, okay? I know I'm going for water and I have to find lactose for my daughter because I drank up her milk, Lord have mercy. And baby girl sleeping today because she's off today. Um... She'll be sleeping all day. She works 12-hour uh, shifts all week. And she works tomorrow, Sunday. And she'll be working the holidays. So I'm going to leave her alone. I'm going to sneak up out of here. And go get some water. Because water is important to her. Okay, guys. And the milk. The milk. I'm not picking up anything I do not need. Just what I need as far as the water and... Um, and uh, 
and her lactose milk and uh, probably a couple of packs of chicken or something some kind of meat yeah guys so hold on for the adventure later